The Shurta are determined to smear my name. Accept this as proof of my innocence. mail and sniff out conspiracies. you ah no get back here Now to find Aribs. Silence your song of sin, or I will do it for you. How kind. Moving on. D. 
dearest Harib, your poetry has touched me deeply. You are my oasis, lush and yearl korof. After the honey drips from her lips, a Thaleb leaves the garden and follows the mouse. Secret order correspondence? Bad poetry? A bit of both? Harib could be a Thaleb. The patron spoke of a recital in the gardens. I could give this letter to Harib and see where the vixen leads me. Please note that your payment of 15 dinars is overdue and must be... No. Abu Abdullah is the true Khalifa and will soon reclaim his stolen throne. I will leave this one for the Uyun. to the garden, give Athalab her letter, and follow where she goes. Rage as the ocean, I will sweeten your storm. Good as the desert, be you ocean, desert, cobra, dove. All shapes and humors will I embrace. Hello there. Have we met? Come, don't be shy. I rarely bite and I never leave a mark. <laughs> it seems there's no privacy in the public eye. How came you by that letter? Who put you up to this? I work in the dark to serve the light. <laughs> I've met the men who serve the light. It seems its glare oft leaves them blind. Are your masters so blinkered and bumbling? You were warned, you son of a dog. Come, Arib. We will set no tongues to wagging here. Yours is the tongue that will not still itself, even when I beg for silence. You spurned the counsel of he who raised you, and without whom you would still be nothing? I raised myself. I authored myself. I have written myself into history. You are banished from my pages. Now be gone! How can I leave you to walls such as these? You're a woman alone, unarmed. Words are weapons enough for me. Then let us see what defense they offer. Take her. There is somewhere the Sayyida needs to be, and you are delaying her. It seems that words can summon shields. We will need to make this quick. Take your Your fate is sealed. <laughs> 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 Come on. Harib has left for her secret meeting. I must hurry. The letter commanded Athalem to leave the garden and follow the mouse. Perhaps Harib is not lost to me yet. How dare you walk among 
us to defy the For shame! Guard! How far will the fox flee? Better keep a low profile. Yet another painted mouse. Another crumb to follow. I am growing tired of this chase. You should bring him before the Mandalian court. But he thinks only of my reputation, Sara. To safeguard success, I must be palatable, discreet. He fears I am too proud. <laughs> you? Never. I write that love is feral and free, unbound by stricter or statute. Should I not practice what I publish? Practice makes perfect. It also makes enemies. So be it. But let me choose them. Courtiers, caliphs, patrons, partners, so many men have tried to decide my enemies. <laughs> and friends. Though Allah knows I once chose poorly, he hid himself well. And the poet needs patrons, even one so great as al -Falab. Well, I have my pick. Good. There's troubled times ahead. I will be fine. I have survived six caliphs. I will survive... Six more. Don't worry, Sarah. I'll kiss the rings I need to kiss, but I will not be bound again. Not by anyone. Secret meetings. Coded names. There is no trace of the order here. Still... She has her pick of patrons. Maybe the head of the order is not Arib herself, but an admirer. I have seen enough from my three suspects. Time to seek Roshan's counsel and end this once and for all. Oh, 
poor likeness. Well met. What do you have? Lent? You never know when these will come in handy. Sold. Have a gear improvement project in mind? Nothing else. I must be fair. Basim, have you investigated your three suspects? You appear decided, Basim. What have you learned? Arib is innocent. The governor less so. He made a deal with the order and removed his cousin's protection from Alamut. Happen. Just as we had feared. We've been bare to our enemies. Yes. In exchange for Abu Abdullah's renouncing his claim to the throne. He seized his crown to suit the order, led by his him. mother. Gabiha is the head of the snake. Where is she now? Fled to the palace. If we act now, we can spare Alamut. Give me the feather, master. Kabiha will meet swift justice, and I will be the one to deliver it. What? What are you saying? That a more seasoned hand is needed. The last time you entered a palace, you left it in disarray, to put it lightly. Have I not proven myself since? Master, I have earned the right. Earned what? The right to kill? No. No, th that is not... A blow from one of us is a blow for all of us. Or does your ego demand the honor? It is not ego, Master. It is duty. I took an oath to leave my life behind, to walk the shadows and to serve the light. I mean to. Abiha is more dangerous than her underlings. Strike quickly and end this. Do not hesitate. Blood from a stone. Who is she to keep you from Kabiha? Or to tell you when to strike? My master and mentor. Without whom I would be nothing but a corpse in the streets of Anbar. You spy on me now? Always. So you will swallow your questions, strike at her enemies, serve without complaint. And live your life dogged by El Jinni in the hovel you once hoped to escape. You know where to find me when your duty is done.
so many dead or disappeared. And each trail of blood leads back to you, Al-Bahamut, the last mask to be lifted. You set Wasif on the rebels, unleashed Al-Ghul, sold your son's crown to seize Alamut. And all for what? Some worthless token of a long-forgotten age. No matter. I will see you at the palace, and I will cut the head from the snake. What do you see? 